Um, we'll just start with uh, the first inning. This is the fifth straight that the Chiefs have scored in the, in the first. How much of a help is that for you when they go out and score so quickly? Um, it's big, and um, like you said, it's scored like 10 runs in the first innings in the series, and it you know, puts them in a hole quick and puts pressure on their pitchers. And, they're starters through a lot of pitches this series, and they get in the bullpen pretty quick. And you know, guys are worn out; they come back in and uh, get out. So, you know, we did a good job doing that. And I, I had to go out and uh, put zeros up on the board, and uh, fortunately, I did that today. And you know, it's our team playing well right now in all aspects. Six innings pitched. It's one of the longer. Is that your longest? Ever. <laughs> longest ever. Okay. Okay. So, does it start to become more of a mental or physical battle for you towards the end there? Um, both. I mean, because I went six, that's probably the most I've ever thrown, and um. You know, I felt okay the last inning, so it's always uh, good to you not know, be too tired, or too uh, sore, and um, just gotta pound the zone more. And walks, you know, walks got me in trouble with uh, throwing too many pitches and not efficient enough. But uh, fortunately, I got out of it and uh, got the win. So that was your longest outing ever? Yeah, I mean, this year was the first start since high school, so I think five innings is the longest before this one. And then I got that number six, so hopefully. How do you feel? Is that ice normal, yeah. or is that just? Oh yeah, I always do it for starts. Every seven minutes starter, but. Yes, no pain or anything. So how did it feel out there? Though? Was, was endurance ever a factor out there today? Or did it feel no, I mean, you know, my first couple of starts, when I go in the dugout with a long inning, just sitting there, I try to move around because I'm not used to just sitting and uh, hanging out. So I try to you know, move my back around and arm and just get loose and stay loose and uh, get out there and use those eight warm-up pitches to uh, my benefit. What were you doing well out on the mound? Um, you know, our game plan was going in. Taylor did a great job yesterday going into them. And I was in the stands, fortunately, I could see their swings, and it was kind of eating them up. And they were trying to go off of a lot of lefties, and we just kept pounding today. And uh, it was pretty efficient in there, getting them off balance, and then speeding their bat up, and threw a lot of changeups to get them off balance. And you uh, curveball later in the innings was, uh, you know, pretty uh, successful. And not to me sliders today, which is a good thing that I can you know, get by without throwing them. You pitched so well on the road and haven't had the same luck at home to feel good to finally get one here. Yeah, very good. I think I saw that the other day. I was like, that. I didn't really know anything about it, but um, it's definitely get that get it, uh, a good one at home and uh, in front of our crowd and you know the crowd on my side and our side and uh, just getting that win. Did you talk to your dad today? Yeah, I did before the game. I'm sure he'll be happy. <laughs> no complaints today. Is this just a fluky thing, the home road split? It's got to be. Yeah. I mean, I've had some bad luck here, but um, too many pitches, like I said before, and. I think I threw 81 time in three innings here, and that's just way too many. You do that, you're not going to be a very good outing.